Whoa, that's a little bit spooky, isn't it? Yeah, those eyes kind of creep people out sometimes. Hi, I'm Jerry Ellis, and welcome to Wildlife Wednesday on Apes Like Us. Yeah, I was editing over the weekend, and I bumped into a bunch of images, and I thought this would make a great Wildlife Wednesday. Those eyes are the eyes of a chimpanzee, even though they look frighteningly like us. You'd almost think this was maybe an early 2018 Halloween special, but no, those are chimpanzee eyes from one of the sanctuaries that I was working at in, um, in Africa. And what I wanted to talk about this week was that white part around your eyes. You know, humans have much more white than almost any other primate on the planet. In fact, um, we're dominated by white. And there's a reason for that. The white around your eyes, that, well, I hope it's white. It was just New Year's a couple days ago, so who knows what color that thing is. But anyway, that white around your eyes is called the sclera. The sclera is the white portion of your eye. It actually wraps all the way around your eyeball to the very back of it. It's made from collagen, which is the most, well, it's like the most numerous protein in your entire body. It adds elasticity to everything you do. It's in your tendons, it's in your muscles, and it adds elasticity to your eye. Well, we're not really sure 100% why we have more white than any other primate on the planet, especially any other ape. But we think it's because humans use their eyes to communicate in a very different way than most other apes do. Like if you look at a gorilla, chimps, bonobos, any of the others, their pupils and irises seem to dominate their eyes. So they actually do have white sclera but you just can't see it. In fact, there was a study done, and I'll put a link to that down in the, in the show more section. There was a study done where they looked at the amount of um, sclera that's white in a gorilla's eye and a human's eye, and they found that it was almost the same, except for because our eyes are elongated, more of that white shows. And that's why, for example, if you have a pet dog, if you're standing there talking to your dog and you're looking around at the dog, the dog's following your eyes the whole time. Well, we use our eyes to communicate like that, where apes don't really want you looking at their eyes. They want to conceal what they're looking at. In fact, the worst thing you could do is you stare right into the face of a gorilla, for example, and this is the reaction you're going to get. So don't do that. Don't stare into the face of a gorilla or a chimp or you know any other ape. Anyway, that's your sclera. You probably never knew where it was, and now you can use it for trivia and fool all your friends. Anyway, that's this week on Wildlife Wednesday. I'm Jerry Ellis. For everybody at Apes Like Us, we'll see you next Wednesday.